So when we look at our delivery devices, so when we look at our nasal cannula, again, so we'll, we'll show you kind of how these come packaged. We have an adult and we have a PD. When we are, are looking to put these on, this is where now we have kind of a range that we're looking at. So we can set it anywhere from, you know, one to six. We kind of max out at six. We can, we can definitely put it on more. The problem is, you know, when we're delivering oxygen directly into the nares, um, this is going to, you know, is cold, dry, medical grade oxygen. So it's going to dry out the, the nostrils. It's going to, you know, be very uncomfortable. So, you know, this is where now we kind of say we, we max out at, at that six liters. When we go to apply this device, so this end attaches to our oxygen tank, all right? So this would be plugged into our oxygen tank, and this is where the oxygen would be delivered. So when we go to position this, we kind of see that if we look at the prongs, they kind of curve that are gonna follow the natural anatomy of the nose. So the prongs come in, and we can see this kind of sits right in the, in the mental here. All right, so as this comes in, and then these come right over the ears, now, Mr. Mannequin here is a little sensitive that, you know, he doesn't quite have great ears. And then this, we come and it cinches right up under the chin. So now this is in place. It goes around the ears, just cinches under the chin. It's attached to our oxygen and we're able to give them, you know, anywhere from one to six liters to kind of supplement their oxygen. This would be for a patient who's breathing on their own. So now we're, we're providing, you know, additional oxygen, but they're ventilating adequately. Okay, it's easy to do. We'll have you do this in lab. And that's, that's how that sits.